bored of your default styling for your text on your website? Well, I'm going to show you how to change that using a simple plugin on WordPress. So this is the 2016 theme, that is the default theme that comes with WordPress, and the text seems a bit bland and boring. More specifically, the paragraphs I'd like to change and maybe add a border to the headings. So I could do this by going into the CSS code and modifying it, but not everyone knows how to modify the CSS code or how to code CSS itself. So to do this, the simple way, I'm going to go into Dashboard, Plugins, and Add New. And then we're going to search for Google Fonts, and it should be the second one, Easy Google Fonts by Titanium Themes, and I'll click Install Now, and it's just installing the package, so then we'll activate it once it's installed, and there we go, it's installed. But you don't get any additional options, you do get an option in the settings for Google Fonts, but that doesn't let you change the actual fonts using the editor, which is a much simpler way. So we're going to go into Appearance and then Customize. And now we are on the front page and it shows us what the text looks like now. But you have a new option that is not normally there by default, which is typography. And if we go into this, we can go in and change the paragraphs, the headings, and a series of different settings for them. So I'm going to edit the font family for the paragraph and then add a border to the headers just to show you an example. So I've opened up the paragraphs and I go into styles and then font family and then I'll choose any old theme. And as you can see, as I click on a new on a new font family, it will update it live so I can see what it looks like before I make a decision on what font to go for. Um, and I like the look of that font, it's quite clean and you can even change the font weight so I can put it to regular, I can put it to bold I can put it to extra bold um, and you put it to light but I'm going to put it around regular for now and you have text decoration you can add to it or text transform, so all uppercase if you want to do that for whatever reason and then you have the appearance, so the font color, the font size, uh, the line height, letter spacing, and then the positioning. But I'll go into that a bit more when I get into the headings. So when you're done with that, you can just hide that away for now. And then we're going to edit the heading twos because those are the main headings being used on this theme. So we'll go into this, and we don't want to change the font family or anything like that. We just want to add in a a border. So we'll add in a border on the bottom. We'll make it solid. And as you can see, it applies to all of the H2s. We can change how thick the border is, the border color. Um, but we're going to apply some padding to the bottom to give it a bit of space. And it doesn't look the best, but you kind of get the idea. You just need to play around with the settings and find something that you think looks good. So that's a really simple tutorial on how to change your fonts and the colors and a range of different CSS stylings for your text. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, leave a like and a comment. There'll be more videos on WordPress plugins coming up soon. And if you want to find out more about web design and any tutorials related to website design, then be sure to check out my channel. Thank you.